supposedly my video was too long to upload. Uh, it was about how to make. Sorry. This envelope. Okay. So this envelope. First thing I did was I painted it orange. The whole thing orange. Then I added some pink right here and some purple right here and just paint that in the half circle. Then I took this piece of cardboard that I crumbled in half wise sort of. And I dabbed it everywhere. And of course I put gesso on the envelope first. Then I turned it around and took the color of my water and put it on there. If your water doesn't have much of a color, just take like a light whatever color. And then you take some oil pastels. Oil pastels. Uh, and you can make some swirls or whatever. Or you could just repaint it, whatever you want. But then you take glue and you put it along the spine of your book, the inside of the spine. And you put the side that doesn't have this part, that doesn't have this part, that doesn't have this part, sorry, y'all couldn't see it, that doesn't have this part on that side. You want this side sticking out so you can open it up and open it and stick stuff in it. You can put your diaries in it, your pages. Uh, if I wanted, I can put my Lisa Front t-shirts on it, in it, I mean. You can see I could just easily fit it in and close it. So, you could do that. And then, uh, well, that's an envelope. It's easy. You can do it with any size, really. Uh, over here, I've got this size. And, um, well, this is my hand, and my hand is not very big. It, this size, which is the same size as the last one, but a different color. You can use whatever color. This size, which is a rectangle, but it has the little design. Or you can even use the inside of the journal. I meant, sorry, the inside of the envelope. Oh, here it is. This, it's six and a half inch width and three and five eighths and a half height of an inch, of course. And then that's our address, which I'm going to cover up. And see, that's the font of the envelope. And then this is the same size, just, just different in size. You can sort of see different pattern on the top. I don't know if you can, but I can. Or you can even bend something into an envelope if you want. Like. I don't know. But you can bend it in, use tape or whatever. And then when you're done, take your art journal up so the glue doesn't go all the way in your book and make the envelope stick to the side of the pages. So the envelope doesn't take up a page, it just adds a piece. You can stick it up and stuff. So that's if you have one without like binding or anything. So that's how you can do it without binding. Uh, really easy. You don't even have to paint it. That was just, I like painting stuff, you know. That's just me. But, uh, really, whatever you want to do. So, alright, bye.